Hello everyone, welcome to this channel and into this video, I'm going to show you on how I handle image files or pictures in Microsoft Access database. Now, let's start. Let's log in first. And here we go, this is my dashboard and let's go to employee tab. This one and this is my employee information form and has... As you observe guys, this is um there's a picture name and file path or the file location field. This is just for demonstration purposes. After this tutorial, I will hide this one. And by the way, the picture will not be saved in this database. However, it will be saved in somewhere in the computer which is um located in drive C. Here. And as you can see, um Drive C and there's no folder named images. But when we start to store an image in this database, the database will automatically create a folder for it. So now let's start. Let's select um, this one, Kim Chu. Let's change the picture. Where's Kim Chu? This one, Kim Chu.gpg. Okay, here we go. So this is the picture of Kinchu already attached and the picture name this is customized guys as you can see 00011 this is from the employee ID followed by his her name Kinchu and also followed by the uh, position which is the supervisor and also the file extension and the file path this one so now let's try to go to drive C so in the drive C so Images files or images folder are being uh, automatically created by the database and here we go so The picture of Kimcho being saved in this folder. Let's try another one Pulo Pascual change Okay, insert And let's go to ok And then Last one, the word of gold pan. This one. Okay, that's my picture. It's up to you to, to believe. So, if we delete this one, like for example, delete. Are you sure you want to delete this picture? So, there's no question mark. I forgot to put question mark. If yes, successfully deleted and the picture of uh, Eduardo Golfan deleted so let's also delete this um, picture of Kim Cho let's just delete okay okay deleted so I think this is enough if you have some questions you know what to do just comment it down below and if you need this uh, sample database just email me that's all. Thank you for watching and see you to my next video.